every time I walk into this building, the Powell building, I still remember the first day of class. And it's funny because when working on, on freelance projects, as well as my own projects like Pasteurized or Nieta, I still hear in my, my head the voices of Sherry, Sherry Sinclair, uh, Bill Mong and Barbara Bradley when I was taking classes with them and uh, telling me, you know, that's not quite right. And still, based on those comments, um, I keep fixing things until hopefully, eventually, I get it right. And yet I was inspired by an old photo of my grandfather and my mother when she was around six, seven years old. And she was wearing a dark blue dress, but in the picture, of course, it looked black and white. And in this black and white film, I wanted to show that Nieta was able to perceive uh, sound as colors. It was very important to me to not reveal her secret to the audience until the very end of the film. The style of Nieta is so minimal that the music was crucial to build up the emotion for it. And when I was talking with Michael Brennan, the composer, I told him that the images, the animation, will follow his music. The roller coaster scene in Pasteurize was inspired by a family trip to Disneyland where my sister begged us to go on the roller coaster. But the moment the handle came down, she immediately changed her mind. This is one of the things that I love and enjoy the most about animation. Even though it takes forever, making it, it's a lot of fun. Bésame mucho, 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 como si fuera esta tarde la última vez, desde es última vez, pero bésame mucho, bésame mucho, 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 que ah. eh, tengo miedo a perderte, perderte otra vez, no va más.